Hello, everyone. It is an honor to be here tonight. I want to thank my family and my loved ones for being the first people I ever learned from. I want to thank Rytopia Lab, my CEO, executive director, and the entire staff for their unwavering support and passion. I feel that I am not alone on this stage tonight. I stand here today with the most caring, passionate people behind me. And I share this accomplishment with my team and the incredible youth that we serve. Every day, I have the privilege of hearing powerful stories from young writers, from flying turtles to shy superheroes to reflections on grief, change, and joy. But today, I want to invite you all to step into my world and hear a story. It's the story of a 13-year-old young man who thought it impossible that he could ever write a story. So, it's our first day at Rikampia, our annual sleepaway camp where 200 youth come to dream and write in workshops, build community with each other, and express their creativity, all while being surrounded by nature. This young man looks at me in disbelief. You want me to write a story? He resists, he cracks a joke, but when he looks at the empty page in front of him, he falls silent. His eyes show the quiet battle he is fighting. Spelling is hard, full sentences are hard, but he really loves Sonic the Hedgehog. <laughs> so we started there, and every day, uh, this young man comes, comes back to write about Sonic. He dictates, I type. On our fifth day, he asked if he could type a few words on his own. On the seventh day, he sounded out the words of a sentence he really wanted to add. And on our last day, this young man stood up with his completed story in his hands, and he asked, can I share this? At Rytopia, young people are empowered to tell their story. And this is a defining moment for many, where they are able to speak their minds and build a reality that they wish to live in. Stories allow for the impossible. And by speaking it, writing it, listening to it, we imagine a world where anything is real. Youth deserve Youth deserve to believe the impossible and create it, to feel the weight of their words and to foster the confidence to speak those words proudly. And in doing so, youth just like this young man are exploring their sense of self and shaping their perspectives. Right now, kids need writing more than ever to not only dream the impossible, but to analyze and understand the world around them. This is one of the most powerful opportunities we can give the youth. The space to believe and to question. This young man, I see him as a storyteller, an engineer, a speaker, a community member. He wrote a story, but he accomplished so much more. As his educator and mentor, I believed in the impossible with him. No idea or thought was too much. And that gave him the space to grow. Writing is an invitation. It's an open door, a question. It is infinite possibilities and more. Thank you. <laughs> 